Hello, everybody. Mike Arnold here, co-founder of Path Trading Partners, along with Bob Iaccino. Quick Tesla update. Tesla going through the levels. We no longer have a potential double top here, so we cannot use those levels. So now we will take them off. So let me take that one off and this other one. Uh, I had a nice spike high up here. Let's see at that what level that was. Let's see here. Sorry about this on a different computer tonight, having some major computer issues today. Uh, spiking up above that 25% retracement, so that invalidated it. So let's take a step back and look now what we're checking out to see. All right, so it's still the critical level is this 25% retracement from this old high. Uh, we have the rising rotation zone. So 330.21 is the level we'll be watching for a close below. We actually, on this spike high, we could not make a new high in the RSI, and this is another major divergence. So things, we're still watching for the pullback now. So I definitely, uh, uh, from an educational standpoint, look to raise your stops. And then if we get the close below 330.21, which will also be a rotation zone, we're looking for the bigger pullback. First area key support then is a 37.5 with the rising 50 coming in at 316.47. Then below that, if we were to go below that, we'd be watching for a return to 300 to 302. Let's check in in that weekly chart to see how those weekly levels look. So from the weekly levels, we also have the rising eight on the week coming in at this 25% level. So that's going to be very key. So if we do drop below that, then the, the next level down is also the 316, which is the bottom of the weekly rotation zone. So those are the key areas we'll be watching. The two major levels we're watching are these 330 and then 316 on a pullback. We won't look at the 316 until we get a close below this 330.21. So we have for you quickly on Tesla and we'll talk to everyone soon. Bye for now.